my name is Tom Loser, and I'm a professor in the art department. And at the moment, I'm also the department chair. I was involved in bringing Linda to campus last spring when she was the artist in residence for the Arts Institute. We ended up having a lot of dialogues about how art fits into the university and and how it could perhaps expand its role on the campus. Well, one of the projects I came up with was um, something I called the Stealth Sculpture Project. The people who work here concentrate so hard, focus so hard, that it's almost like nothing can break that focus. So I thought, well, what would happen if I started putting sculptures around without any information about what they were? And the person coming upon the work has to sort through it with less externally provided information. And I thought that was a kind of a brilliant move. Because I believe this. I believe that when you're working on a problem, you work on it and work on it and work on it, and then there's this moment when something else catches your eye or you're distracted. And that, in that weird little window, I think that that's where intuition or good ideas come from. And one of the things I love to do is find a way to, to get people out of it long enough for that intuition to come in. When I set up sculpture at WID, I say, this sculpture is a metaphor for a problem you're trying to solve. What is it? And that's, I think, what kind of unlocks creativity, is if you can uh, identify what really matters to you and what is the problem that you want to address, then you're going to be able to go at it and attack it. What's exciting is uh, I think that what started to happen over the last year is that there really have been a series of interesting ways that the arts have been brought into the building and the with research and I think it's really exciting things are starting to happen so we're really, I'm really excited about that.